so Daniel was a man who had been influenced, and then in those very early days of captivity in Babylon, the scripture says, but Daniel purposed in his heart that he would. And in this case, it was that he would not defile himself with the king's meat. But I think we could leave that sentence, but Daniel purposed in his heart that he would put the Lord first in his life. Many negative things against him, but he was determined that he was going to stand for the Lord. And then as he went on later in life, we could follow that through, and he became a real leader within the country of Babylon, and then even in the country of the nations to follow. A man that had a real commitment. But then one man cannot do it. You have to have a team that is centered around that leader to be able to go ahead and make a work progress. And so you go from a man to a movement. Happy here today with all my friends. 